There you go. It's already recording. I have my beautiful wife, Michelle, behind the camera. I'm not sure of the count, so if it's wrong, sorry. But this is We Don't Know What We Are Doing, episode number four. And today, I love GoPros. I'm a little cranky with them about how the latest camera came out just as the final mod, media mod for the previous camera came out. But other than that, I do love GoPros. But one of the gotchas is how do you attach a GoPro to an RC car? Now, the most recent RC car I got was a Red Cat Gen 8 V2. Beautiful car. You can see, look at this. Look at this perfect green. Isn't that beautiful? Um, so I wanted to figure out how to do it. And one nice thing about this is you can go ahead and see if you want to attach it to the top. It's just plastic. You don't have any ribbing here that prevents you from doing it. But then that's sitting on top of the car, which means if you're taking videos of the car, it's very visible in it. Um, it's okay if the, I use magnets. That's what I would recommend a lot of people with stickies, but I, I use magnets. I was thinking to myself, is there a way, can you point down this way, honey? Is there a way to get it so that you can mount it in here? So I started looking at my different GoPro mounts. And the one that made me most interested is this one. I'll put a link down below. This is a, is it same, same top? Can they see that label? This is a same top um, mount here. And what it is, it's just a clip with a mount. And it's, if you try to do it one-handed, Michelle, can you confirm that it's pretty hard to do one-handed? Very hard. Right. Um, so it holds on pretty well. So what, what can we do? Now, if you don't mind pointing down here, love, you'll notice that one of the nice things about the Red Cat design with the, I, I don't know about the Gen 8 V1, but with the V2, notice it has one, two, three, four. I've only got three straps here, but it has four places where you can strap in the battery. Now I did, here let me point back here, you can clip it here, we may do that sometimes, that was kind of a neat effect wasn't it honey, because you can see a little yeah. out of the side ones, outside ones here, but you do see the wires and stuff and it won't be the same. So I wanted to bring it forward, but you can't bring it all the way up here, because if you, are you pointing this way now? Okay, if you bring up here, even if you could clip it above the engine, the fact is, is the cover isn't high there, alright, that's where the engine is. So we like. Can we put it here? And Michelle gets credit too. So we thought about with the battery. So let's go ahead and grab my battery. Oh, there's the Z. Love Z batteries. So this is a 3S 45 milliamp hour. Um, what is it? A, uh, I can't remember what it is. Oh, 50C. 50C. And so what you want to do is <clears throat> they give you two straps with the vehicle. You're going to need a third strap. Don't know what you're using for battery. This even has a place where you could, it appears you could put a short battery. But what you want to do is you want to take your battery in. Do not strap this one, the third one. <clears throat> Slide your battery in. And then what you want to do is you want to strap the, the first one tight. Make sure that that one's really, really tight. And what you want to do with the second one is put it just a little bit loose. And what we're going to do is we're going to take the clip. Where did I just set that? Where did I put my camera? Uh -oh. You clipped it to the back. Oh, it's right here. Good. See, thank you. See, that's why, don't, isn't that what your wife is for too, finding what you lose? Okay. Basically, we want to slide this under here. And as I've said, since you can use both hands, it is a little hard. Might be you want somebody else to help you, but you just slide it under here so that it is as tight as you can, but you've got to have enough to be able to slide it so you can't go too tight. Okay. Then this is not going to be totally secure. So what you do is you take this third strap and you come over the top here and do it like this. And what's important is you want to make sure if you look here where the, the spring is to do the clip, if you look here, you want to make sure that this strap goes on this side of the spring. You don't want it on this side because you might try to open it. So you go like this, feed that through there. So it kind of goes over the same top label and you go like that and now it's attached and then take your top make sure your wires are in I don't have the battery hooked up right now but make sure your wires are in got the light kit in last night make sure your wires are in set this over here get it to a line and oops the side's not going inside there we go this one, there we go. And then what you see is a little camera poking through there. See that? And there is clearance. I don't know, honey, if you can get here so that you can show them that there is clearance with the top that way. That's okay. It's okay. 
the, the, the important thing about clearance is this, is when we tried to do it, because we were trying to get as front, close to the window as we could, we initially attached it to this strap right here, but what was the problem, honey? It bumped. It, it bumped. turned the camera off. No, actually, that, that's something else with the GoPro right now. Um, the, the, this curve here, got that? This curve here came too far, so it, it just wouldn't go down. So this middle one is the best place. But remember, there are four spots. One, two, three, four that you can do straps. So depending on what you have for a battery and stuff, what you have for straps, uh, this one will have to be a bit longer, obviously, to get over the top. But def depending on what you do for battery, you do for straps, you can do it this way. So this... We didn't know what we were doing ahead of time. We might find out when we go to use this in real life that it doesn't work great, you know, if you roll the car or something like that, but it seems to work. We looked at a video, didn't we, honey? Here in the basement, we recorded a little bit. Looked on the computer, it looks good. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop here and I'll wrap up this video with some outside video that we take a little later with my son and see how it is. Oh, last thing is, I, I it's going to be interesting. We gotta clean this, obviously, but this is not truly glass. So I suspect it's still going to have some distortion, but it's still going to be pretty cool. And heck, if you've got your head cam on and you're taking pictures that way anyway, why not? Anything else before we wrap up, love? Can't think of anything. You don't um, want to tell them how wonderful I am? <laughs> of course you're wonderful. But she's more wonderful. Anything else? No, that's it. So we'll see you guys in a bit. Yeah. Come on, slow poke. <laughs> Part of it is your tires are pretty slick too. Just do me a favor, don't uh, don't kick you know dirt up on uh, on me. Yeah, I mean just don't do it purposely. See, here's the first old tree to go around, right? Can I get around it? I don't know. Yeah, I think the grass is going to be a little high, there, a little wild there. There we go. Oh, I forgot. Whoa! Oh, wait, 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 what's that? That looks like a piece of metal. You huh? better not flip yourself over because you're not allowed to go off the path. I just realized that. Uh oh, did I get my first scratch? Did I get my first scratch? Yeah, it looks like it's okay. Let's do this, huh? Oh. There you go, getting dirty. Tree. I think I can go around that tree. Kind of funny if I roll over the poop by mistake after giving you a hard time. So this one, you see these weeds and stuff can get in the way. All right. See, I'm not sure I can get around that. Yeah. Uh-oh. Because you're human. It's fun. Oh, that was close. Almost hit that. Here, I can come around. Let's hope. Can't see. There we are. Ready? Yeah, look at that. Look at that. That was awesome. Oh, big bump. Okay, dirty boy. <laughs> is this fun? Yeah. Yes, it is. This is the most fun walk I've had. Well, let's see what we can do here, huh? There's no good path up this thing. Huh. Yeah, these rocks aren't 
they're not gonna work out terribly well. Look at that, Augie, look at that. She's slipping now, but look. I think it's pretty amazing she got where she did. Uh, now the question is, can I get out of there? Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, looks like it. Okay, any other rocks of interest? I suppose I can go over there, let's see. What do you think about this rock here, huh? <laughs> Tumble Wumble. What's wrong? <laughs> Speaking of tumbleweeds, I think I just went over some poop maybe. Uh -oh. That's okay. It was dry. In a minute. I can't kick up dust like you can. Now the sunlight's coming out. This is gonna be some good, good colors. Close. Me and my shadow and Augie too. Oh, so I, I will let you do it I a bit. No Mistakes were made. You can check the tires when we get there. Oops. Do you need a shove? A little bump? Huh? No. Did you just spit up dirt at me? Sorry. Yeah, you horrible son. Let's see, do you think I can get around the, uh... What? Do you think I can get around that? Find a path? Mm -hmm. Whoops. Oh, that's a pretty nasty plant, whatever it is. See, I can't see everything over there. Uh oh, there's something in the way there. Oh, that was close, huh? Yeah. And of course, I can go in here. Have we passed? We haven't passed yet, we're still here. We're gonna, Dad's gonna do a little bit more. Dad's gonna use up the battery and then make you do it. So what do you think, can I get down there and come back up? Uh oh, front row. <laughs> well. I don't know if there's actually a path. <clears throat> I think I, I think I can find a path. Just a second, I'm come back up top. Okay, let's see if I've got the path, right? <laughs> okay, I give up. I thought I found a path, but I didn't remember it correctly. Yeah, I had to turn here. Oh, I could go straight through the, well, I don't know. Oh, well, we tried. We tried. Oh, 
Okay, Ray. So right now, I wouldn't. So try to get up. Try to look for a path where you don't have to go through the deep weeds, right? And then try to get up around the tree. And then see if you can get up, come around, and then can you see the hole over here? Oh no! Tumble wumble! If I get bit by a snake, like you said, it's all your fault. Got stuff in my shoes, though. I blame you for that. I'm gonna wear longer socks that go up above. Come on up here, yeah, little smarty pants. Uh oh. I'm up. Yeah, okay. Guess that didn't work out quite the way I hoped. <laughs> I just had to gun it. It's getting dark, huh? Here, okay, stop for a second. Please, thank you. Here we go. Is it hard to do a scene if I'm doing this? <clears throat> No, I, I think your foolishness adds to it. <laughs> and away it goes. Now my turn to jump it. Well, maybe I should bring my car back around first. What do you think? Just in case I land? I can't see it though. There it is. Wait. Where are we? Oh. There it is. See it. Yeah. Let's see. I want to go like that. Bring it back over. Otherwise, Murphy's Law would be you jump right into it. Go for it. No! Way to go. Great driving there. He just hit me. Wait, do it again so I can put the camera on it, right? Trying again? Yeah. Do you want me to give you a push? No. No. <laughs> it's fine. It was, cause the, the fact is, you don't have tires. You would have to get like maybe some paddle tires or something. Something that's gonna grip. I don't know, we'll see. Maybe tomorrow night, we'll decide. You literally said in the car, maybe tomorrow night. I did, and I just literally said it again. Do you like how I'm circling this? Can I come through, please? What's the password? Pretty please. Wrong. Snuggledorf. I'm coming around, careful. Coming through. You're lucky, I don't have the heart to hate you. No, well, could be that and being grounded for the rest of your life too. What? Huh? Now how do I get back to the surface? Ah. Happy trail! to you until we meet again happy trails to you I agree what well, look excuse me Although there is some horse manure to watch for. I drive this home like this, Augie, right here. Drive it home. Actually, Augie, you wanna have some fun? <laughs> Come on. Do you see the trail across the road? Huh? Do you see the trail across the road? We can cross the railroad 
Well, there's a fence there, I think. I oh, know, I guess it's on the other side. I hope I hope the camera here is picking up some of this. I wonder if this is still recording. Is this still recording? Yeah, still recording. Okay, ready? Let's make sure we don't have any traffic. Be a shame to get run over, huh? We're good. Now my thing's pulling right again. Whoa! This would be a good place to get a hundred mile an hour speed pass. So the question is, can I turn around up here? It's funny, it's turning it. The uh, road must be pulling it places. That's cool. Look, here oh. it comes. Up. It's okay. Um, yeah, I think this would be a good place to do a hundred mile an hour speed pass. See how long that stretch of road is? More than long enough. Well, of course, if there's no car. Well, just keep an eye. Cars can come quickly. Good news is, car coming that way would have to come up over that hill. It's the other way. Oh, you see the hill up there? Yeah. Yeah. I think this may be getting slower. Uh oh. Whoa! Tumble wumble. Oh! It recovered! <laughs> I cannot believe that mine recovered like that. Okay, dude, don't hit me. My trim is horrible. It's going left again. You know, the body is actually doing pretty good given. Oh, I've been going up against grass and stuff like that. It's so dusty, but it is. I think I want to go up here one more time. Then we'll call it a night, okay? Did I show you the video where I can't remember it was a guy who was doing it with his E Revo or see it, it pulls it. Okay, car coming. Back it up, back it up, dude. Okay, I think it's a good time to say good night. Reach at the car. Oh, somebody's coming. Uh, hey, let's make sure we shake out some of the dirt and stuff. Let's see if the camera's still going. It is. It's still going. So when I put this video together, folks, this car. Oh, I do have some scrapes right here. I don't know. We'll see if they come off. Um, this car is just amazing five stars oh by far this the car is amazing beautiful and you can see me come here say hello come here and say hello yeah exactly and that road up front is actually pretty good for speed passes 
It is if we're careful, huh? Okay, folks, that's it. Let's wrap this up. Turn off some cameras. What? Please leave a like, subscribe, and smash the bell. Exactly.